how's it going guys? My name's The Linking and welcome to my unboxing of Wolfenstein The New Order Occupied Edition. I bought this from game for £47.99 and because of that I got these posters and I'm going to be unboxing those them as well for you guys. So first of all we've got the box for Wolfenstein Occupied Edition as you can see. Just a normal front cover with the developers and also the Doom Beta. The code is inside, I'm not going to show you it because <laughs> I actually want that. But here we have just a normal description, a couple of screenshots and what is inside the Occupied Edition. The Occupied Edition comes with 20 page travel guide to Occupy Britain, Wolfenstein travel card holder and a set of free postcards. Now, the only other thing on here that's very different to normal is this HDD 49 gigabyte memory that you can't really see on this on the video because I can't really get it to focus. But pretty much that is you have to download fi install 50 gigabytes to play this game and that's a lot, but because it's installing not downloading, it might be qu slightly quicker if your internet's really slow like mine so i'm just gonna get this open just gonna peel it open because that's the easiest way to do it and then let's get this off so it feels really nice the box is like really smooth and yeah so hopefully it won't have a sticky tab there you go so i hit the tripod there so as you can see we have the game first of all wolfenstein the new order Again, inviting you to the Doom Beta. What well, I'm annoyed that that's on there because that doesn't exactly look very nice on the box. But we're going to get this out first. This is a travel guide to Britain, 1960s edition. So we've got a contents page, getting around, welcome to Britain, accommodation, food and drink, films, music music again sport piccadilly circus southwest britain northern britain and important messages basically this is just a spin-off of like different movies and stuff that we have now just tasted to nazi tastes so i think i think that's really cool that's a really cool like addition i'm just gonna put it here and now we're gonna get if I can actually get it out oh no that's not actually a thing that I'm trying to pull out there but no, nothing else in there we're just going to chop it over there right so here we have the postcards I'll get them open in a minute as you can see they're like that's like the Beatles I think it is like logo but a Wolfenstein version so I'm just going to open this up Show it to you guys. We've got this one and an upside down one. Ah, oh, look, Nazis on the moon. I think that's quite cool. I like that one. And uh, a Nazi kissing a woman in front of the Eiffel Tower. So they're really cool. They're like, again, spin offs of postcards now. So I'm just going to tuck those in there. Now we've got the Wolfenstein travel card holder. Just a normal like bus pass kind of thing. Yep. So that's those. And now we're gonna move on to the the game itself. While I unpick this. Yeah. So like I said, this has a 50 gigabyte install and a 5 gigabyte day one patch. I I find that quite annoying. I hope the rest of the PS4 games are not gonna be like that because. It will just take forever to play these games. I don't know how fast it's going to go because it's a PS4. Hopefully it will go in like 20 minutes, hopefully. So there's a box. The same as on the back of the Occupied Edition box. And it also says it's network features, 49 gigabyte minimum. HD video output, 720, 1080i and 1080p. And remote play supported. So we're just going to get this out. I'm just going to check where the DLC code is. Right, so this is the Doom... Uh, beta DLC. I'm just going to cover the code. There you go. That's all it is. Very simple there. I'm just going to put that down. We've also got the instruction manual with a very cool picture of a robot and BJ Blazkowicz telling you 
um, the controls. I'm guessing they're just normal like shooter controls and then some information on the back. And then the last thing we have, of course, is the CD Wolfenstein The New Order. Nothing particularly special about that. So now we're going to move on to the posters. These are only a game. They come in this really nice box with a like full coloured soldier, but then like black soldiers around the side. Just silhouettes of soldiers. I think that's really, really cool. So let's get this open. So we're going to take... Uh, the f I, don't, I don't know how many posters are in here. I was told there were three. So I'm guessing we're just going to unroll it like this. Yeah, so there's one here. So the first one we have, I'm not going to be able to show you it all at once, is BJ Blaskovic. Just standing there looking really, really cool. Going down to the bottom with the Wolfenstein logo in the corner. It's really hard to show you this, guys. He's standing on a robot's head. Yeah, so that's... Oh, that's BJ Blaskovic. That's definitely going on my wall. That's really, really cool. Um, now we're going to head on to the second poster. I'm not really sure what this one's going to be, but... Oh, this is the Wolfenstein logo. Uh, if I can actually get this down. I'll just scroll it up, sort of, with Wolfenstein New Order at the bottom. That's cool as well. I don't know if it's just put all of these up in my room. They're all pretty cool, but i got my Titanfall poster as well. And my Destiny poster to get put up. And then the final one is a landscape one. Slightly smaller, this one. And it has the neo-Nazi soldier and then the silhouetted backgrounds again. That's I like that one. I like that one more than the other ones. I'll probably put that one and the BJ Blaskovic one up. They are definitely the coolest of the three. So yeah, that's about it guys. That is the unboxing for Wolfenstein New Order Occupied Edition. I have all the stuff around here. Just going to put these back in the box. Nice and simple. So that was pretty much all it came with. If you get this from game, you can get all these posters as well. And also, you can, if you trade in games, you get 20% extra to if you buy a PS4 or Xbox One game. And that's really, really good. I think that's a great deal. So I sold my Injustice Gods Among Us for £19. And I thought that was really good. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I will have an unboxing of Watch Dogs when that comes out, which is actually in like five days, I think. So I'm really, really looking forward to that. And make sure you subscribe if you want to see my new gaming setup where I'll have these on the wall. And if you want to see my Q&A. So thanks for watching guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed. And I will see you soon. Yeah.